Well, we're off. Another adventure. Another after work bassin trip. I guess you could say. Ducked out of work a little bit early. And we're off to downtown Pittsburgh. We're in the south side. Getting ready to launch. And go out and see if we can't catch a couple bass tonight. I haven't been down here in years, so this is going to be pretty cool. Um, I just really want to go catch a bass in downtown Pittsburgh, so that's the main goal tonight. Just catch a bass in downtown Pittsburgh with the backdrop being the city. That'll be pretty cool. So I'm meeting up with uh, one of my sponsors, the uh, owner, CEO of Angler, the app for your phone. Angler Labs. So we're going to be tracking the whole trip here using the Angler Bullseye and on my Angler app. So I'll even share this to my public profile. Put a link in the description below so you'll be able to click on that and be able to see our whole trip. Where we took off, where we went and fished, when we caught a fish, if we catch any fish. Um, so it'll be a lot of fun. Stay tuned for all that. Hopefully we get some good footage. If nothing else, it'll be pretty cool to be fishing in downtown Pittsburgh. So let's go. It's about time to get after it. We're almost at the ramp, stuck in a little bit of traffic, so we're a little bit late. But there's the city. We're just about there, and it's go time. We can catch some fish here tonight. We got beautiful Pittsburgh right there. At least the sneakery's all right. Hemostats. <laughs> Landon's got them on already. On the crankbait. Yeah, what do I do? Gosh. <laughs> How about that? It was. He followed it right there to the boat. Always. Oh, he's still there. Dang, that was cool. I was winding in to throw at that little boulder right there. It was a nice one too, chased it all the way to the boat. Yeah, we'll fish it, yeah. There's a bunch of little places out there. Her, uh, her family, her aunt. What is that about? Hello. 
<laughs> That's a fluke. Little fluke, yeah. Just a little guy though. Oh, he might be 12 inches. Yeah, that little, little fluke junior that catches them. Unbelievable. I didn't expect it to be great, but I expected to catch a few more fish than this. You had one? Well, I think we gotta go down by the ramp. Couple spots down there. Look at that guy. Hello there. Yeah. Open up your mouth, buddy. There we go, another one. Back to back cast. Open up, buddy. A bass in Pittsburgh. What is that? That would be. That counts. That's, I'm bullseyeing that bitch. <laughs> what? How do you even do that? I, no clue. That's. That's like, a fish. You got him. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta leave him on there for extra flash. Exactly. <laughs> Golly, that was a big one. Yeah, that was a fish. Messed up my cricket.
I can't believe we didn't catch one right there. No, we did not get skunked. Oh, there he was. Missed them though. Gosh dang. Getting dark before it's even seven o'clock. <laughs> yeah, I think so. It's depressing. Yeah, I can't decide which is worse. Waking up at 6 a.m. and waking up at 7 or getting dark <laughs> at 7. <laughs> Uh, I know it. Well, that's a wrap on this video, guys. Man, we didn't catch a whole lot. We had a few few bass. It's pretty cool though to get downtown Pittsburgh, especially with Landon, get out and catch a couple bass and uh, enjoy fishing in downtown Pittsburgh. So on the way home now, figured I'd uh, get some Chick-fil-A. That's gonna be my dinner. Life is a bass fisherman right there. Fast food for dinner. Get home and uh, Maybe catch the end of the hockey game. Was fighting the traffic on the way into the ramp about the hockey game, so might as well go home and watch the rest of it. And uh, it was going on right over the hill from where we were fishing, so it's pretty cool. Thanks again for watching, guys. Please give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.